Well, the neighborhood market in El Sereno is turning to the community for help. The owners say it's been a tough year for small businesses like theirs. KCAL's Elise Martinez shows us why some say this is much more than just a market. Come on in. When you step inside El Sereno Greengrocer, it feels like a step back in time when markets were the focal point of the neighborhood. Our nourishment is happening in different ways. People are gathering it in terms of food. People are building relationships with their neighbors. Most people who come here are in walking distance. Neilan Jana Banerjee says her five-year-old son Kabir tasted his first passion fruit right here and now he keeps asking for them. It's really great to be able to like, come here. We know the owners, where we're meeting other folks. There's a place to sit. We're learning about fruits and vegetables. People come in here and it's like, oh my God, I haven't had this since I was a little girl. Oh my goodness, I haven't tried. I can't believe you have chocolate covered bananas here. Or chorimoyas. <laughs> or zapotes. Owners and spouses Patricia Torres and Erica Crenshaw are celebrating one year in business in an area they say desperately needs healthy food that also represents the multicultural families who live here. We are in the technical food desert here. Basically, there is not like a supermarket within a certain mile radius. There are these sort of mega discount stores, but there's no market selling fresh, local, organic produce, and then definitely not selling it at reasonable prices. The first time small business owners bring in produce from the nearby farmer's market and say they prioritize partnerships with BIPOC farms and vendors. We are thinking about equity both from the staff perspective and the farmer perspective. Everyone is being paid fair wages. The couple says it's been a tough year. A loan from the bank was denied. And now they're hoping an infusion of cash from an online fundraiser will help them move forward. For many in this neighborhood, El Sereno Greengrocer is more than just a market. It's a celebration of culture and community. It's kind of, it's just everyday magic. And that's what we get to see every day. Everyday magic. In El Sereno, Elise Martinez, KCAL News. And the owners have started a GoFundMe page to raise money. You can find it on their Instagram page, El Sereno Greengrocer, along with their business plan.